Hey guys, Luke from DLM here, and today we have a big spoiler. It's two or three days old, but I thought I'd show it to you nevertheless. Straight away, you can see a new background. These are just the big things that cover most of the screen. You can see a new background, better block blending, and uh, some more slopes around the map. Okay, so going to the second image. This is just of the hot bar and the new chest. Um, you can straight away notice that there's a fifth slot added to the inventory instead of just the four, so more inventory space. And the chests are twice as big. I'm not sure if it's just um like golden chests, maybe maybe normal chests don't have double chest size. I'm not sure it didn't state that. Redigit it didn't state that. So close up on the inventory we can see breaker blade, shotgun, then a new gun. Uh it seems to be in the same range as the number the name like T as the number four chainsaw. Number five is a new drill in a pink or pink bar which is really cool just below that you can see the bar and under seven you can see the ore number six is the mini shark seven pone hammer eight looks like a flare gun nine is new torches under number six you can see a new ore really cool i'm not sure what it is so that's two new ores at least and under number three you can see wings and number one is actually the Orb of Light, or I'm 90% sure because Redigit has stated that he renamed the Orb of Light to the Orb of Shadow and recolored it to darker colour so it makes more sense into the, into the corruption. Going back an image, you can see that there are three or four, or two or three new items in the ammo slot and the chest. In the chest, there's a new accessory, kinda guessing it would be an upgraded version of Feral Claws. claws. One up and then right of it, it looks like a new clay block, maybe. And then in the ammo slot at the bottom there is a new cartilage or cartilage or um canister for a bullet. Okay. Jumping forward we can see a world map and we can see a lot of people and things going on here. So there are ten NPCs here and that's more than even the um last update had and this isn't showing all of them. It's not even showing the pirate and maybe I'm guessing the person above the nurse is a painter, I'm not really sure, but it kind of looks like a painter hat. Anyway, so we have a new guy above the nurse and two more new people in the Redigit's house. Also on the far left you can see a pink house, that's kind of cool. New blocks there, going back again you can see the new ore makes this armour I'm guessing, and behind that armour you can see a pink anvil and a pink forge. So might work the same way as the adamantine forge and the hellstone forge behind the guide you can see a kiln looking object not sure what it is going into accessories you can see a ranger emblem uh, something that looks like a shiny red balloon mixed with some kind of honeycomb thing a new pair of boots a hermes boots and a honeycomb looking object this no idea what those three are but they are going to be awesome more rope going down the elevator uh, you can see the two new chests here, there is jungle chests and ice chests. I really like the look of the ice chests, but not the jungle chests so much. That's just my opinion. You can see a new NPC, kind of looks like a cyborg or a spy or something cool like that. Not sure what it will say, may sell maybe accessories. But anyway, you can also see on the table behind him, there is a new placeable potion. So I think you can place potions like you can see in the dungeon that's cool going right again you can see two more types of flowers just aesthetically cool and you can see a third purple chest and some kind of barrel kiln on the left this is as far as the photo goes so I'm not cutting anything out and then we also have some kind of maybe a fortune teller or like a priest oh, priest not the right word like you know the guy in Harry Potter who's a douche in Harry Potter 1 um, Professor Quirrell, yeah, I think it looks like him, he clearly went a Voldemort on his back, but it looks like him, so that's the last photo, thank you for watching, if you liked it, please leave a like, if you're excited, as I am for the 1.2 update, leave a comment, and if you really want to see more photos, um, more spoilers and stuff, just leave a subscription, goodbye guys.